There's been a lot of talk over the past couple of weeks about the new joint venture partnership between Yellow Brick Road and Macquarie Bank. Now, of course, Macquarie Bank are not new to the home loan sector. In fact, they were an active market player prior to the GFC. Mark Burris, the founder of Yellow Brick Road, he has a wealth of experience as well. In fact, he was the founder of Wizard Home Loans, who ultimately then went to sell the Wizard brand to GE, who at the time were their wholesale funders. Well, let's just have a look at this structure and see how it works. Through Macquarie Bank funding, Yellow Brick Row will be offering a 1.25% discount off the standard variable rate for the first 12 months. After the first 12 months, a loan reverts to a discount of up to 0.91% off the standard variable rate. Now Macquarie Bank own 8.3% of Yellow Brick Road, hence their interest in the wholesale funding. Now Channel 9 also has a stake in Yellow Brick Road through Nine Ventures. They hold 18% of Yellow Brick Road. Now there's no doubt that the path Yellow Brick Road are going down is the right one. In fact we do need competition and a lot more of it. The four pillars, the top four banks in the industry, well that's just not enough. We need more competition out there. In fact, more than 80% of the loans out there are being written only by the top four banks. But the question is this, Macquarie Bank were a big player before the GFC. Once the GFC hit, they left the marketplace. Have a look at this comment that came up in The Australian last year. One of the emails from Macquarie Bank business development managers to brokers said this, why not try Macquarie for the below reasons? No docs. Clients only need to be self-employed for one day or more. No assets and liabilities required. No income needed to be stated. Now Mark Burris earlier this month suggested to Fairfax Media that they needed to write approximately $350 million worth of home loans per month to be taken seriously by the banks and start chipping away at their dominance. Now that's all good. Again, I encourage competition. But to take away competition from the banks by loosening credit policies would not be the way to go. Let's hope Macquarie doesn't go down that path again. I'm Miggy Damiani, I'll see you next week.